Welcome back to Teach a Man to Fish channel. Today's video is going to be fishing for mackerel and sea bass out of the Rudy Inlet in Virginia Beach. Let's go ahead and get started. So for the first one, we're fishing off the golf ball. That's what they call this area in Virginia Beach. Okay, so I know you don't have to do ikijimi or the Japanese method of killing the fish, but I'm just gonna go ahead and practice this on these mackerel. They die really quick anyhow. So you puncture the brain and then bleed them out. There's a couple other steps with the backbone. There's a lot of videos out there on how to use this procedure to make the fish more fresh and keep uh, quite a bit longer in your refrigerator. In this trip, we trolled for Spanish mackerel and then went out to a wreck just beyond the Chesapeake Bay Lighthouse Tower and caught black sea bass on the bottom, holding tight to that wreck. This Spanish mackerel isn't really like the mackerel that you get in your standard sushi store. That's usually Boston mackerel. This is a much less pungent or fishy tasting fish. I can honestly say it smells mostly like the ocean as you're cutting it up. Very fresh, very white meat, very tasty. As you saw earlier in the video, we used planers and spoons with a leader running back and we caught them on the planer and then hand lined them in. I knew that we wouldn't be here. That big one probably just came in here to try to catch a few spans and take them out for bait. Wait, what? Hey, it's got a spanish. That bird. If you like the sushi version of this, stay tuned till the end. We also do a cook on the Lodge Sportsman's cast iron grill. Waste not, want not. That's the 
the sounds of freedom, Oceano Naval Air Station. Not fishy at all. So YouTube says that this video is perfect for your viewing habits. This is my latest upload, and over here is a playlist that you might enjoy.
I hope you like it. If you did, please click like, subscribe, share, and come on back for more.